Now let's just have a single bulb, a single cell, a single switch, and a couple of um, wires. And you know that if you go ahead and close the switch, you get a certain amount of brightness. Now what I'd like you to do is to, while this is going, come to the bulb and do a control click and change the resistance. You notice the resistance is set at 10. Why don't you jack it up to 25? Do you see what happened to the brightness? How about if you take it down to around 5? Around 5. And you compare that again to 10. So I hope you're seeing a relationship between brightness and resistance. And you can also, oh wow, I hadn't noticed that before. <laughs> Everything's on fire. That's pretty cool. So anyways, I'd like you to do this just to get that kind of sense. And then what I'd like you to do is to set up a series circuit that has two bulbs in it. And before you close the switch, set one of them to have a resistance of 10 and one to have a resistance of 25. Now, as you've been noticing, that the higher the resistance, the um, dimmer the bulb. And so you might expect that in a series circuit that has high resistance and low resistance bulb, go ahead and build it and see if that's what you get.